So one of the reasons why I, I chose to do a PhD is I was always really excited about science, engineering and art. And what I wanted to do is just kind of get a bit more in depth into some of those foundations and bring together all those ideas. This PhD was an opportunity for me to apply computer graphics, computer science, uh, basics of thermodynamics and build something that's beautiful at the end of the day. The key soft skills that I learned during the course of the PhD is how to communicate. So quite often you're communicating to different experts within academia. And so when you're doing that, you need to be able to set out your initial assumptions, explain the work that you've done through the course of your, your investigations, and then leading to a set of conclusions. That's really important in the work that we do at Dyson. Um, quite often we're working in brand new kind of area of research. There isn't clear um, roadmap of, of what the answer would be. So it's really important for us to be able to explain the results that we've come up with, the research that we've done, leading to solutions that are practical to get into customers' hands. One of the, the key lessons that I learned through the PhD is it's not a straight linear path. Uh, it's quite winding. You'll set some assumptions of the research that you're going to do. Those assumptions are going to be challenged. So whenever we got into an area that is, is kind of new, um, it was hugely valuable to try and find subject matter experts to, to help you interpret what you're finding and to establish new assumptions and ultimately work towards solution of your research.